Right before you post it, let me change the name. Hey Gail, what is going on? Hope you are well. a few minutes early just to help people find this we have a lot of new people tonight I'm excited about the break too I wasn't so excited when I discovered I had a typo in the listing, but otherwise I'm pretty excited. <laughs> Hi, Baseball Brownie. Thanks. Thanks for getting in on this. Very excited with our FOTL and our hobby box. I'm gonna give my little spiel here uh, thank you so much everybody for coming out tonight most of all thank everybody for paying wow I went to double check before the break started every single person had paid that is so much easier for me makes life so much smoother very excited um, thank you so much for buying in every card and every break that we do ships to you it ships to you quickly and it ships to you in the condition it comes out of the box we do our best um, to make sure that all happens uh, relatively smoothly. We don't offer skunk protection, but we do always send out some packs, cards, sometimes autos, relics, what have you. Um, if you don't get a hit, sometimes even if you do, just uh, because we buy into breaks too, we know what it's like when you pay for somebody or a team and you skunk and it's kind of a bummer. So we definitely don't want people going home from here with the sour taste in their mouth. Uh, as a result of that, tonight we're going to start off with the Immaculate. We're going to follow that up with a really cool Leaf Rookie Retro Break. That is coming next. Uh, we're going to open up the Hobby Boxes first. We'll save the FOTL till the end. Uh, if it works out well and everybody likes it, we do have two more FOTL and two more cases of Immaculate downstairs. So this break could happen again, or it could happen just FOTL, or it could happen with a two Hobby Box case break we'll figure it out but we definitely always try to do full cases if we can unless it's a super high number product I learned that uh, a little less is better on that and Marty is that our spiel oh and tomorrow night we still have a break live before we head to the national for a couple days tomorrow night we are doing a serial number break of signature series active player edition that is live that is a full case 20 boxes of that as well Hey Richard. Hey Sean. I haven't been looking at the uh, the words here, so the words, the, the, the messages. So sorry if I miss somebody. Marty is typing away. Uh, yeah, this should all go out before the national. That's my big hope. We leave on Tuesday, uh, so we're there for the preview. If anybody is going to be there, be sure to say hi. I will be there in my little Susie Sport shirt, so you will know who I am. We're going to be there for the preview in the first morning. We are psyched. 
And we usually get started about five minutes after the call time again, just allowing people to find us. If you are new, please chat. If you are not new, please chat. We do like to talk with people. And of course, always let us know how the video and the sound are. I'm going to start opening this box. All right, as soon as you open this box, uh, thank you, everybody. I know we do have some new people watching. There's 28 people watching right now. I'm sure we'll be adding some new ones. James Andy Schutz, good to see you. Also wishing you good first time mojo here. Wishing everybody luck. Uh, this is your first time here. Susie and I, uh, you know, we, we, we certainly fall into a lot of breaks ourselves, obviously. And, uh, you know, we certainly know how it goes. We try to really take care of people. You know, and we like to say nobody goes them empty handed. We do send people stuff. Typically it's, uh, you know, cards, uh, packs, uh, autos, sometimes relics. You know, we know what people pay. We do try to make sure that, you know, obviously, again, if this is a player break and you're buying Baker Mayfield, we can't send you a Baker Mayfield, but we can try to send you something nice to really try to make you feel good. And that's what we do. And we also ship quickly, safely. We'll do our best, Jason Taylor, try and make sure we don't skunk for you. Craig Johnson, I would love to pull Sweet Sandberg for you too, but I'm not pulling. It's all Susie's mojo. And by and the Susie's way, been on fire. If you didn't see our first case of Immaculate, it was ridiculous. We had uh, Vlad come up, Bobachette came up, we had Franco come up. Uh, and again, sorry about that time misleading uh, thing. I didn't mean to do that. I must have looked at the wrong month when I double checked my date. There is no way I intended to do this. Oops, I forgot my little breaking card, my little spacer that I like to use. Hey, Posty, how are you? Good to see you back. Certainly know that name. Dan Frank. Wishing you good luck, too. Yes, good luck to everybody. Good luck. Are we ready? And thank you guys for your understanding again about that typo about the date. I sent y'all an email today via constant contact and answered, I think, everybody who asked about it. And I apologize. Not my normal thing. Yeah, and I know we have a lot of regulars here, too. We were saying, again, nobody goes in empty-handed. Our, our regulars here know that, you know, we do take care of people. And, you know, that there's a reason we've been breaking for a while now. Over a year now. Yay, us. All right. Let's keep it going. Susan. Who's ready? I think a lot of people are ready. I think we're ready. And we're starting with something awesome. Jonathan Davis coming out here for Toronto. This is a jumbo jacket. And that is the E, if I'm not mistaken, in Blue Jay. Because damn, that is some card to start our night. This is numbered four of five. And it is beautiful. Dang, right away. And that is Jonathan Davis. Going out to Balrab, 13. Congratulations, Balrab, 13. Way to go. Very nice, right away on the board with a sweet one. Let's keep it coming. Joe Adele coming out here with the Jumbo Relic. It's a single gray color, but it is nice to get that hit. This is 21 out of 49. And definitely Joe Adele is a, a guy I'm sure we're going to be hearing from a lot in the future. Top prospects in baseball. Well, how about Reggie Jackson making an appearance with the Stripe? Beautiful. And the blue dark patch. This is 24 out of 25 on the Legends, Reggie Jackson. Not too bad. Let's just check. It is game used, too. Congrats to the Reggie spot. Very nice to the Reggie spot, definitely. Player I personally collect, as anybody who's been here a lot of times has heard me say. And that's going out to Baseball Brownie. Bang, BB. Congrats. Let's keep it going, because I thought buttons were just going to be an FOTL, but that is not true. Check out this sick Jake Cave. Beautiful red button there in the corner. Three-color patch there on the bottom, and the on-card auto for Jake Cave. That's three of ten. That is sweet. Wow, Jake Cave. We had a huge card of him uh, in the first case, mm -hmm. if you recall, with, like, uh, what did it have, two laundry tags or something on it? Yeah. Like, it, awesome. it was, uh, yeah, it was a three-relic one. And two of them were laundry tags. It was ridiculous. Let me see. Jake Cave tonight, because that is a sweet card. Jake Cave going out to Beastie 2400. Congratulations to you. And we'll do our best, BB. How about Justice Sheffield making an appearance on card auto five relics? And those are sweet, too, with the dark, with the thick blue stripe, excuse me. Justice Sheffield, very nice card. That is numbered, sorry, 26 out of 49. Very nice. 
cards, some of them so thick. It's I know, they're crazy ridiculous. how thick some of these cards are. And let's end the first box on Michael Kopech. Very nice. This is nice. 12 out of 99. Two pinstripes there on the bottom. There is a pinstripe hiding up there in the top relic, if you can see it as well. And Posty, who we called out already. Posty, brother. There you go. 12 out of 99. Way to go. See, good mojo returning for you, Posty. Good to see you back. And nice hit. Susie, did you point out that little piece of dirt there at the bottom of the middle? I did not. Here, let me let me just leave the card and then show the coat back one more okay. time. Just to, it's a very nice one out of 99. Just want to point in again, I think Susie said, let me see if this is game used or player I used. I didn't know. It's, uh, let me see, the enclosed is guaranteed by Panini. It doesn't say if it's, uh, yeah, oh, it's player good. use, player use. Okay, show at the bottom in the middle square. Oh, yeah, there is a, a piece of dirt. There's a little something. I don't, I, I don't know what it is. If it's dirt or I wouldn't call it a fuzz. dirty relic per se. This one is heavy. Yeah, so whatever it has, Posty, it has something there. We're not going to try to take it off or anything, so I'll leave it here for you to take a look at. This one is mad. But a heavy. very nice hit, nonetheless. Do our best, Gabe B. Look for Nick Senzel. That's a sweet one, too. We could pull it. Oh, Abdiel is with us. What's up, Abdiel? What up, Abdiel? I think these are just super thick. I thought we might have had a booklet or something, but no, just super thick. Let's keep it going. We have Caleb Ferguson coming up here. This is the Jumbo Stripe on the Relic. 7 out of 15 for the Dodgers. But I know it's for the Caleb Ferguson spot, but for the Dodgers, very cool. Who was it? It was uh, Caleb Ferguson. Caleb Ferguson, let me see. Caleb Ferguson going out to C.H. Kerr for... Next up is Albies. It is a small but mighty relic. Black, 42 out of 49 on the Albies relic. Second Nick, year. good to see you, Nick. What's going on? What's up, Nick? Not sure, Nick. We will go through this. I have not called out every single one because they're, fly they're flying fast and furious. Good to see you. Next up, a very large piece of white Mike Piazza. This is numbered 5 of 31. Interesting little number there, but that is a single relic. You do see a kind of indent or stripe going through that. Um, that is on the threading, and it is game used on the Piazza Jumbo Relic. And then for my fighting fills who actually won a game today, we have Emil De Los Santos. This is 15 out of 49. Nice uh, Phillies relic in there for a Phillies fan. Beautiful red stripe. Dig it. This is uh, the rookie card, 15 out of 49. And you has got a promising arm. I'm not sure if he'll be in the uh, rotation long term or if he's a reliever. The Phillies are trying to figure that out. So, Aniel De Los Santos going out to Rick142. This is Jonathan Luciaga coming up here for the Yankees. Beautiful relic there. You can see the, two, uh, the stripes behind what looks like a, a part of the name or numbering on there. This is 13 out of 49 with a nice on-card auto on the rookie card. Jonathan Luciaga. Let me check my list here. Jonathan Luciaga. Nice picture for the Yankees. Uh, let me see. Jonathan Luciaga. Sport fan. Congrats on that. Congrats. Nice one. Yeah, and nice one. Just to keep the good leg going, how about another Michael Kopech coming out here? And this what? one is very sweet. You have the stripe on the bottom, three colors on the top, sticker auto, eight of ten. Yeah, Posty, that is, I mean, that's much better than the first one. This one is killer out of ten. Oh, my God. Well, the what first a one is on card. But, but this one is killer, Susie. This one, wow. Bang, Posty out of the uh, Michael Kopech spot, just killing it. Damn. Wow. These cards are thick too. They're in, the boxes feel super heavy because there's so many thick cards. There's a them. lot of boxes. A lot of times for players to come up a couple times. But we're wishing good luck for everybody. Hopefully, we can yeah. spread the love here. But for Posty, obviously, they have Copac twice. It's sweet. So, congratulations. Let's keep it going. A couple white napkin relics coming up. This is 27 out of 49 on the Daniel Ponce de Leon coming up. That is the Jumbo Relic. Our next card for somebody to get in on the action. And 
keeping it going with another large white napkin relic. Although I still would take it 29 out of 49 on the Brandon Low. So congrats to those two spots. Yes, yeah, give me a second. I'm trying to catch up here on everything. Okay. Yeah, those napkins are hot. Jason Taylor loves it. <laughs> we got Miguel Cabrera coming up here on the Gray Relic. 71 out of 99. Go into the Mickey spot. Very nice. Spreading the, the love, I think. I don't know. I don't have the list up. It's like 20 pages long. So yeah, yeah, has I'm, a copy of it. I'm trying to do that, but yes, trying to also... Uh, well, here's Mission one you're going to want to look up because it is beautiful. How about this Cedric Mullins on the Clutch Rookie? Check that out. Two colors on the relic, the name on the black in gold. Gorgeous card for Cedric Mullins. And Cedric Mullins killed it in our first break. We got yeah. the uh, Fielding Glove, which was sweet, and the Auto. This that is one is sick. 10 out of 15, and it is awesome. Congrats. Cedric Mullins going out to Balrat, 13. Wow, Congratulations. second hit for you. Very nice. And Brandon Lowe, let me see, did, did that one come up? Brandon Lowe is Big Fish Yukon. Congratulations. There you go. Not sure who else I missed. I know I missed. Daniel Ponce de Leon, let me see, Daniel Ponce de Leon was, uh, looks like STL, St. Louis Car Collectibles, congrats on that. Congrats, and how about this sweet hit coming up for Kansas City, it is... Not Kansas City. Brad Keller, not Kansas City, you're right. Brad Keller coming out for the Brad Keller spot, very nice. Three blue, two white, on card auto, very sweet card. This is eight out of 99. And that one going out to Andre Hawkins. Andre fucking won. Congrats on a very nice card there. Very sweet for the uh, the Keller Swift. Well, here's one you're going to want to look up. How about Tatis coming up here on a beautiful card. On card auto, five relics, two bat. Booyah. That center relic wow. there, two colors. The bottom relics, two colors. That is gorgeous. Coming in at 26 out of 49. Wow. Congratulations. On the sick Tatis. Going out to Jay Wellis. One. Congratulations on the Fernando Tatis. I love it. That is an awesome, awesome hit. Love that card. I mean, it, again, sometimes these cards, you look at the relics and, uh, you know, they either detract or, you know, sometimes they really add to the card. This one, the two bats on the side, sweet, nice grain to them. Beautiful card. Different colors. The one at the top, the brown, uh, the classic brown with the, uh, the light and the two pinstripes at the bottom. In the auto, well placed beneath the, uh, you know, the picture of him. It's a sweet card. Wonderful hit. Congratulations. Good to see you, Travis. We're not even halfway through the case. We still have the FOTL. Let's keep it going here. We have Reese McGuire coming up. 37 out of 49 from Toronto. And this is a little gray relic that is getting somebody in on the action. Very nice. Reese McGuire. Yeah, and if you missed that, Susie has the two FOTL boxes uh, all the way to the left stacked up. And, uh, yeah, they will go at the end here. And we've got 46 people watching. If anybody missed any cards, we'll do a full recap also at the end. Corbin Burns coming up here on the Immaculate Jumbo. At least it's not white. It is a jumbo piece of blue, and I'll take it. 30 out of 49 on the Burns. Who was it? I'm sorry. Corbin Burns. Corbin Burns. Uh, all right. Uh, yeah, I was trying to chat, too. Corbin Burns, let me see. Corbin Burns going out to Starkey, 24, congrats. And how about Ichiro getting in, 21 out of 25, very nice. This one is two gray relics, but they are sweet for the Ichiro spot, game used. Yes, and I know there's a lot of uh, people hoping Ichiro hits uh, in the next break too, in the rookie retro. Ichiro hitting right here though, uh, let me see, where did I lose the uh, page of Ichiro? Ichiro going out to Starkey. So Starkey, two in a row there. Very nice. How about, I'm going to mispronounce this, Siono Perez? I think that's 34 out of 99. Nice rookie patch auto here. It is on card. Two colors on that relic. Would be for Houston, but tonight it is for the Perez spot. That's going out to Slump Buster. There you go. Buster wow. Slump. Slump Buster. Wait till you see what we have next. Who is it? It is Mitch Hanniger, one of one printing plate, on oh card God. auto, two buttons. Oh my God. That is insane. One of one on the Hanniger spot. Wow. Wow. What can you say to that? And Mitch Hanniger again turned himself into one of the best hitters in the league. 
And wow, Keith grabbing Mitch Hanniger. That is just sick. Incredible. Congrats, yeah. Keith. Wow. And here is one of our older players. And in this box, it is Burp Bly Levin. And it is sweet, beautiful on card auto here coming for Bly Levin. This is 13 out of 49. Very nice card for the Bly Levin spot. Wow. Yes. Oh my God. Yeah. Baseball Brown, I'm with you. That card was redonkulous. Redonkulous. Oh my God. And Burp Bly Levin going out to Rick. One, four, two. Yep. Congrats, guys. We do like to spread nice the wealth around. Good luck, everybody, as we continue. We are halfway through the, the um, what's the word I'm looking for, the hobby boxes. Haven't hit the FOTL yet. Wow. What do you mean? I feel like a waiter at a restaurant. Everybody should applaud when I drop something like that. As long as it is not the cards, we are good. Well, this is pretty darn sweet. How about this immaculate jumbo? I'm assuming it is a sock of Danny Jansen coming up for Toronto. That would be the second Toronto sock I've pulled out of this product this year. Seven out of 49. T uh, Toronto, definitely team. When we have our next break of this, uh, we'll do a PYT probably. And uh, yes, uh, definitely they're a great team to have. And what was it, Danny Jansen? Danny Jansen. Very nice hit there on the Danny Jansen. Going out to RM Stump, 84. Very sweet. Congratulations. Very sweet. Yes. And then let's not forget Michael Kopech. He needs to come oh back. Oh, my God. Michael Kopech for the third time? Yep, on the Immaculate Jumbo. This is just gray, but it is still the okay. third Michael Kopech hit, 26 out of 49. Yeah, what can you say about the Michael Kopech spot? It's uh, paying yeah. dividends. Yeah, it's paying dividends, Posty. Next up, we do have Bregman coming in on the Bat Relic, and this is a super thick card for that Bat Relic. This is 9 of 10. Nice low number there. I'm just going to point out that if you look at the Bat Relic, and I'm going to bring it closer so you guys can see it, you can see there's a little white underneath, like it wasn't as fully set in there as one would hope. I just want to point that out so that when you get this, you don't think I somehow shifted it. But it is still pretty sweet. Super low numbered out of 10. Let me see what you mean here when I'm putting this away. What do you... When you look at the relic, you can see the white underneath oh, it. The yeah, relic's yeah, a little yeah. small for the space. That's all. Yeah, I, I guess... Yeah, I guess um, it hasn't really shifted yet. Like Susie said, they, they just... It looks it, like it was cut a little too small. That's all. Yeah, if you're like... Uh, if you're looking down at the card from an upper angle, you can see white. But if you're looking at the card straight on... It fills the bat, is what Susie means, I guess, is the best way to describe it. Again, like, it's cut a little short at the Ooh, bottom. chest protector? Yes. That's pretty cool. Very sweet. How about Caleb Ferguson? He is up next on the rookie card, rookie patch auto, 31 out of 90, on card auto, two colors on the relic. Very sweet. Caleb Ferguson going out to CH Curve 4 again. And uh, let me see, Alex Bregman also went out there to... Maddie D. Congratulations, Maddie D. And how about the dugout collection here? This is Kevin Kramer, sticker auto. This is four of ten, another super low numbered card here. Two colors on that first relic, three colors on the littler one, four of ten for Kevin Kramer. And the Pirates, if they were the Pirates, very sweet. Kevin Kramer, again, a guy who is just uh, impressive. Very, it's, I guess, the best thing you can say. Kevin Kramer, just killing it. Beastie, 2400 That is a sick card. Congratulations, again, for one of the better rookies. You know who else is killing it? Me, because here's Eloy Jimenez coming up. Three Bang. pinstripes there on the bottom and the gray relic on the top. Very sweet. On-card auto, rookie patch auto, 37 out of 99. Love it. Love on the it. Jimenez. This case is great. And Eloy, let me see what Eloy. Hold on one second. As Susie uh, changes boxes here. Eloy, uh, Eloy, going out to our friend, Big Fish. You come. Now you see, and now you love those white socks. Yeah, love to see it, Big Fish. You come, Eloy Jimenez, paying huge dividends tonight. That's a sweet card. Mm -hmm. I know it's ninety-nine, but they really gave you a really nice card there. Nice relics. 
the pinstripes, they give you three pinstripes there on that at the bottom, gray relic at the top, very nice. Very nice, baseball brownie. Wow, that's a sweet card. Let's keep it going. Four relics here on the Jose Barrios. Nice, coming up. This is 37 out of 49, two white, two gray on the Barrios. Next up, we have Joey Gallo for Texas. And the Joey Gallo spot, 37 out of 49, two blue, two red. Not bad. Yes, was in this year's All-Star game where he hit a home run, although he took a, uh, i trying to think how he got injured, but he did, I think, broke his, broke his jaw, I believe. Okay, well, how about this? Another sock. Tatis coming up again, and oh, this God. is ridiculous. The San Diego sock. This is one of six, and damn. That's all I can say about that. That is amazing. I, I mean, what can you say to that? You it's know people player are used, want. but... Yeah. Still, you know people are going to want that card. That is sweet, especially with the auto already. Oh, my God. The Tati spot. I think I called it out already. Obviously, I know I did. But Fernando Tatis, Jay Willis, if you are in the house, Jay Willis, please say hello because you just killed it, Jay Willis. Oh, my God. That is awesome. Let's... A hammock bone in his hand. Thank you. I thought he took a... Uh, I thought he broke his jaw or something. But Here we you. have Kobe Allard coming up on another ridiculously sweet relic. This looks like an 8 or something. I don't even know. This is 8 out of 49 with the on-card auto. Two colors on that first patch, three colors on the bottom, but you can see it is more than a three-color patch. It is sweet on the Kobe Allard. Very nice to the Atlanta Braves in the Kobe Allard spot. Let me say, uh, Kobe Allard, where is he? Kobe, sorry, going out to Big Fish, UConn, killing it, Big Fish. How about this sweet one? This is Sean Manea coming up, and I know I talked to somebody who had him. Two colors on the patch, sticker auto, one of five. Oh, my God. Nice Sean Manea. Wow. Oh, I'm sorry. Three colors on that top auto. The gray is at the top, white and green. It is a beaut. One of five. Wow. Sweet on the Sean Manea. Let me see what the Sean Manea is, Susie, before you go on. Sean Manea going out to Biggio, 57. Nice. Very sweet. How about Jose Abreu coming up to end this box? We still have four boxes left, everybody. Two white relics and the on-card auto with the numbered 75, but the card is 14 out of 25 on the Abreu. And if you want to see the one-of-one -one printing plate of that card Susie just pulled, look at our last break. We pulled the one-of-one -one printing plate of that, the Jose Abreu, with that picture, Susie. So that's crazy. We pulled the printing plate, and now a very nice, again, Jose Abreu coming right back. I mean, the odds of him coming right back when we pulled a 101 the last time. So, Jose Abreu, let me say. Going out to, oh my God, Big Fish Yukon. I had a feeling. Damn, Big Fish Yukon just murdering it. Well, those White Sox are coming up in ridiculous quantities. He loves it. I don't think Big Fish Yukon is complaining in the slightest. Wishing everybody luck. Yep, there's yeah. Gary. Gary's Check with us. this one out. How about Ryan Baruki coming up here on the Majestic Patch? Three of five. That is sweet. That is a very nice one. Wow. Not a bad way to start a yeah. box. Yeah, two out of five, too, if you didn't call that out. I That's did. so nice. Wow, the Ryan Baruki. Let me just see before you move on, Susie. Ryan Baruki. Let's see. Lost the uh, art page there for a second. Ryan Baroki going out to there he is, Biggio 57. Susie, we had the Sean Manea. Now he got the Ryan Baroki. Nice run there, Biggio. And then we have Xander Bogarts 28 out of 49 coming in on the Great Relic, but nice to get in on the action. Don't want to go home without a card, so I'll take that. Biggio 57, if you're in the house, say hello, you're killing it. And after that one, we do have Javier Baez. Beautiful relics here. This first one is three colors because there's a little bit of blue over there in the corner, if you can see it. And the stripe on the second one, very nice. This is nine of ten on the Baez. Go Fiji Frank. Fiji Frank. Nice oh, card. Fiji. I love Fiji Frank. That's an awesome card. Javier Baez, of course, one of the best players in the league. And this one out of ten. Killer card, Fiji Frank. 
Well, that. Speaking of killer cards, check out this beautiful three color relic here on the Bryce Wilson from Atlanta. This is 15 out of 99 rookie patch auto. On card auto, I should say. Very nice card there. Wajada 200 Jason. There you go, Jason. Uh, Very sweet, and I like Bryce. I like Bryce Wilson. I bought his Tops Now card when he won his first game last year. Got an auto of that. It's a nice one. Coming up next, we have the Urias coming up for the Padres. But it's not the Padres. It's the Luis Urias spot. Very cool. Oh, that's sick. Or is oh it God. Urias? I'm not sure. 46 wow. out of 49 on this. Black relic and two colors on the second patch. Again, just a beautiful looking card. And the eye season. black signature. Very well, you nice. Agree that just, some of these are just really just... The way they set them up, the pictures they chose this year, that is just a really nice looking card. So Luis Urias going out to Nick. Not, not Nick. <laughs> there you go, Nick. Well you well. wanted to get on the board, and that's a Congrats, sweet Nick. one. Sweet one, that killer. Well, I'm not sure who has Roger Clemens. I'll call your name because that is ridiculous. That is not a relic. That is leather. That is either a batting glove or a piece of his glove. I'm not quite sure. Very sweet. Eight of ten gold signature on the chalk. Board. on the Clemens clutch yes guy I love the rocket um, you know should be in the Hall of Fame right now I mean how can you how can you keep him out of there it's crazy going out to Fulio USC there you go Walt. Walt there you go very nice out of 10 a killer card Walt very nice on the Clemens I love it very nice Clemens and Stang Lover, you know we're always pulling for you. Well, always love to get your there's name. there's still three boxes. Don't forget, there's two FOTL boxes have not been called yet. Yes, the, the, the big time hits are coming, hopefully, with the FOTL. I think we've had some pretty awesome big time yeah, hits. Yeah, sometimes so. it's not always like the, the bonus card they give you even. they I think they just put some things occasionally into the big, you know, big hits into the FOTL boxes. We too, shall see. If you follow my logic. First up, Austin Meadows, 25 out of 49 with the white relic. Hi. Piggy bid bids seventeen. Congratulations there, and then we have Corey Kluber coming up thirty three out of forty nine on the gray relic. Very nice as well. Corey Kluber, let me see. Corey Kluber going out to. Let's make sure Rogue Smoker, very nice. Grats, Rogue Smoker. Very sweet. How about Casey Stengel on the Relic? Very nice. This is 5 of 25, and it is player used, maybe when he was coaching. Managing, managing, managing yes. yeah. Casey yeah, well, Stengel. The, yes, Casey Stengel, Hall of Fame manager, Susie. Yes. Absolutely. Yes, so that's a very cool one. Going out to Keith, very nice. Uh, very nice hit there, yeah, the 25. Nice Hall of Fame, Casey Stengel. How about 2019 Panini Immaculate Collection? Uh, card set pure. Card number five, Alan Trammell. Alan Trammell, yes. Very nice. Trammell. I don't know what card this is specifically. It just says pure. Have to look that one up, but yes, very nice hit. Nonetheless, Susie. I mean, I just don't yes. know if there's an auto. Alan Trammell, right? yes. I believe that is a, uh, it's definitely an auto, I'm sure. Alan Trammell, M-A-R-F-G. I won't even try that one. Uh, M-A-R-F-G. It's out of five. Thanks, Vincent W. giving it. It's out of five auto. That's awesome. Beautiful hit, yeah. Beautiful hit. Awesome hit there for the Allen Travel spot. And yeah, it's M A R F G. If you're here, let me know how to pronounce it so I don't kill your name. Well, we have another one of one. I don't know what it looks like because it is upside down. It is another beautiful printing plate. Check that out. This is David Fletcher coming up on the one of one printing plate. Sick. You have three colors on that first patch, two colors on the other patches. Sticker auto. He did sign a little bit off the uh, sticker there, if you can see that. Wow. But Booyah. It is awesome. Here, that is just killer. WKND uh, Attitude One. WKND Attitude One. I don't know the name, but if you're in the house, please say hello because uh, obviously this is your first time here with us. And it's so nice. This card is killer. The auto printing plate with two very sweet relics. Wow. Congrats on that. Nice one on one hit. And to end the first part of this break, this is John Smoltz coming out on the jumbo jersey. That is 
is uh, is it game used? It is game used. Sticker auto there. I don't even know what you mean to end this. So you got two more huge boxes? On the, the first part, I meant. Oh, there's and then, no end of the first part, yes. Fine, fine, fine. To end the hobby boxes. Here we go. And that has uh, some stitch in there in the middle. It is game used on the smolts. Very nice. This is 8 out of 15. A guy who does show up, but he's awesome. Yes. Hall of Famer. Wajada, two, zero, zero, nine, four. I should have known. You love Atlanta. Congratulations there. Yes. Congrats. I'm with you, Vulcan, pulling for even some more big hits here. All the people who have big players want big hits. And again, no one's going to go home empty-handed. Know that we uh, do take care of people. We really, uh, you know, again, the we people who have been with us here. Yeah, a deal. I know a lot of other people have been with us. You know, Posty knows us. We've called out. You know, Nick, a lot of people here, you know, obviously have, been, have bought with us before, know that we do try to really take care of people. This is the first FOTL box, guys. I'm just trying to get the top off. Take your top off. Take your top off. <laughs> Let's keep it going here. On the FOTL. Very sweet. We have... Chris Davis coming out. This is a two-color relic, 9 of 10. Nice low number there. Yes, one of the best home run hitters in the American League. Nice little relic there. And the yellow continues up there at the top. Can't really see it, but there is enough P at the bottom. Terrace. P. Terrace, congrats on the uh, one, 9 out of 10. Low number there yeah. with Chris Davis. Well, Marty, you might be right. They might give us more because check out the sweet Mariana Rivera double pinstripe, two relics. That is awesome. Wow. Um, and it's game used on the Rivera. Hall of Famer, Mariana Rivera. Very nice. Wow. Sweet hit for the Mariana Rivera spot. Let me see who grabs him. Susie. Hold Congrats, on Jason. Mariana Rivera. Is that who you said? Mm -hmm. Jason? No, oh, no, 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 no. Oh. I said congrats. Julio USC. There you go, Walt. Walt. Very nice pull there on the, uh, wow, very killer Mariana Rivera. How about Ted Williams dual relics coming up here? That is Dang. beautiful. 10 of 25. Includes game used on the Bang. Ted Williams. Bang! Ted Williams game used sweet. I mean, Mariana Rivera and then Ted Williams, like I said, they always put good things in these boxes. Even regardless of the FOTL hit itself. Not even talking about that. That's going out to, is it going out? Let me just make sure I got it. 2D13 Collectibles. Congratulations. How about the button relic from our first FOTL box? It is Luis Urias, and I know who that's going out to. Two of ten to wow. Nick. Wow. Nick. Bubba. Bang. What's it out of, Susie? Ten. Out of ten. Bang, Nick. The first FOTL hit going to you. But we still have two cards left in this. Let's keep it going. We have Keith Hernandez coming out. Beautiful auto. It didn't come out on our first break. It came out on our first break in a six, Cardinals uniform. And this is also Cardinals. 16 out of 25. He's such a beautiful signature. I'm even looking at him on the screen, and it's gorgeous. People probably cynically would say Susie's had a lot of practice. <laughs> you know. Uh, all right. So Keith Hernandez, let me see. Keith Hernandez going out to Stang Lover. There he is <laughs> in the house. Our well, buddy. And yours, Stang Lover, out of 25. Killing it, my friend. There well, you go. Check this out. How about Bo Bichette to end this box? That is 18 to 25, and those relics are Bang. popping out, if you guys can see that. They are popping out of this. That is a beautiful relic. And lots of little threads hanging off of it, though, and that is a nice on-card auto as well on the prospect. Bo Bichette. Where is Nick? Oh, my God. Wow. Nick, booyah on the Bo Bichette. Who I just read before the break, Susie. What did I just read you before the break? Bobachette's awesome. Bobachette to the major leagues is what I read. Bobachette, they are promoting after making a trade earlier today. I forget who they traded, but uh, they cleared roster space. And Bobachette is coming to the majors. Nick Booyah. Damn, the Luis Urias twice. Got two Luis Uriases and now the Bobachette to kill it. Kill this it. This is the final box of Good the luck. night. Good luck, everybody, on the last FOTL box. Again, if you do not get a hit, know that we do take care of people. You know, no one goes home empty-handed. Let's keep it going, shall we? How about Noah Syndergaard to start this box? This is 8 out of 25. There is, it's hard to say, it looks like almost oh, two colors. Oh, I'm to Noah. 
Who I know? Was it Posty? I'm not sure. I don't remember. But didn't he just get traded? No, I, oh. I just said that they acquired Marcus Stroman. Oh. So what I read was that if the Mets acquired a starting pitcher, it would be so with the idea that they could trade Noah Syndergaard. So Noah Syndergaard, let me see what the Noah Syndergaard. Noah Syndergaard, posty. There you go. Well, this is a little strange. Quality control at tops is a little repetitive with Mariana Rivera coming up again. Dual pinstripe. That is also out of 25. Nice little collection for you there. I don't think anybody's going to complain about him coming up twice or that card. If you have the Mariana Rivera spot, you're very excited. Well, how about the Ted Williams making a second appearance? What? That's a little oh strange, God. right? 22 out of 25. We have two more FOTL boxes. I don't think, uh, yeah, we I do think if we do a player break, people are going to be hunting for the Mariana Rivera spot and the Ted Williams Wow, spot. wow. I mean, that, that's crazy. We just got two of the same cards right there. Uh, yes. Yeah, it gets crazier. Well, this is not a repeat. We have Luis Ortiz coming up this time. Two of 10. Coming up with the button this time. Another out of 10. Beautiful. Who was it? I didn't hear. Luis Ortiz. Luis Ortiz. Congratulations. Let me see what Luis Ortiz. Luis Ortiz going out to Old Benny. Old Benny killing it. Well, I'm Two laughing because Keith Hernandez is here again, too. Oh, my in God. In our FOTL box. So maybe there's some standards. I don't know. Has anybody else seen wow. any other FOTL boxes? I've never seen that. Yeah, I've never seen it's that. It's a little weird. Wow, but Stang Lover is not complaining. Oh, well, my God. Nobody's going to complain. This is the last card of the break. Adrian Beltre coming up. Sticker auto, 5 of 10. Bang, the Hall of Fame are sure to be, yes. Very nice coming up here. And, of course, it's game used on that final card of the and night. And you know he was there at the beginning of our break to bid. Montana, 0826. Congratulations on a very nice Adrian Beltre card. Wow. What can you say? What can you say, Susie? Say some things Why I get the order. You can say, that was pretty sweet. And we have more Immaculate and more FOTL. So you might be seeing another player break coming out. Maybe uh, we'll throw I, in two cases of Immaculate. I do not know. Yeah, we'll figure it out. We'll figure out what we do here. But wow, those were good cards tonight. Thank you so much, everybody. And I really hope that you uh, got your hits. If not... No worries, we will do our best to make the sting go away. But also, uh, stick with us. We're going to be opening up some Rookie Retro pretty darn soon. And then following that, tomorrow we have a break of Signature Series Active Player Edition. And that will be going um, tomorrow night. And it's going by serial number. We thought we'd try that again. We liked our first serial number break. Yeah, serial number break. Uh, if you didn't see our first break, I mean, our first case was ridiculous. We pulled what, like... Six, Six one of ones, ones, including a trout. Yeah, including a Mike Trout that was ridiculous. Nick pulled it in here. Richard uh, Mol uh, Mulcrenin, thanks so much. Wendy, sorry about thanks. that. Again, we, we know sorry, that. Uh, and Rob Brown, we know you went zero for seven here. Sorry about that. And uh, Baseball Brownie, thank you. Um, you know, congrats everybody got hits again. If you didn't get a hit, know that we do take care of people. We will try to send you something. And, uh, you know, it, again, we, we really, you know, we, we bought into a lot of breaks. So we, trust me, we know how much of a bummer it is. Not <laughs> Sorry, game. That sucks. Yes. Let's do this recap. We have Joe Adele coming out here. That is out of 49. Miguel Cabrera out of 99. Syndergaard out of 25. That was low numbered. Corey Kluber out of 49. Austin Meadows out of 49. Xander Bogarts out of 49. We had Joey Gallo, four relics. That is out of 49. Uh, who do we have here? Jose Barrios coming out out of 49 with the four relics. Very nice. Uh, like a weird angle all of a sudden. We have upside down. Corbin Burns coming out here. That is out of 49. Michael Kopak, one of three hits. That is out of 49. Reese McGuire out of 49. Also out of 49 is Brandon Lowe. Also out of 49, Ponce de Leon. Caleb Ferguson out of 15 on the two color relic. Mike Piazza out of 31, interesting number. Ozzy Albies got in there out of 49. Ichiro out of 25. And Bregman out of 10 on the bat relic. Hit me. 
Let's keep it going. Reggie Jackson got in there with the pinstripe and the black relic. That is out of 25. Nice low number there. Chris Davis got in there out of 10. Two colors on that relic. Casey Stengel on the old fabric swatch. Very sweet. Five out of 25 on that. Javier Baez got in there. Super low numbered, I thought. Yep. Nine out of 10. Three colors on that first relic and the pinstripe. The Majestic Patch, three of five, nice low number there on the Ryan Barucki. Beautiful jumbo jacket that we started our night with on the Jonathan Davis for Toronto and the Jonathan Davis spot, excuse me, four out of five. This is a sweet, I'm assuming sock of Danny Jansen coming in here for Toronto. It says Immaculate Jumbo. The other ones do say socks, but the material leads me to think that. Seven out of 49. This is definitely a sock on the Tatis. Beautiful with the San Diego written there. Very sweet. One of six. Rivera got in there with the two pinstripes, followed by Rivera getting in there with the two pinstripes. Both of those are out of 25. And of course, for the relics, the two Ted Williams relics that came out of the FOTL boxes, that is 10 of 25 and 22 of 25. And frankly, we bought these boxes uh, separately and one off the internet. I don't know which ones we got. It's just a little weird that we got so many of the similar hits. Here we go with uh, Brad Keller coming in for KC. That is 8 out of 99. Perez, Siono Perez, I think. 34 out of 99 on the two color relic and on card auto. The Burp Y11, very sweet on the on card auto. 13 out of 49 on that. The Cedric Mullins is beautiful. 10 out of 15 with that gold signature and relic very nice caleb ferguson got in there with a two color relic at a 99 kevin kramer on the dugout collection very sweet that is out of 10 a lot of low numbers here tonight for seattle or i guess not for seattle but for the justice sheffield spot that's 26 out of 49 15 out of 49 on the annual de los santos Bryce Wilson got in there on the three color relic. Yep, three colors out of 99. Very nice with the on card auto. Nice on card auto and a beautiful bottom relic. The top relic has two colors. That is Colby Allard out of 49. And the dual Keith Hernandez autos, both out of 25, 8, and 16. I think I've pulled uh, how many Keith Hernandez is out of this product now? Three. Very cool. Let's go with Jose Abreu, 14 out of 25. He did number that himself with his number 75. Very nice. Adrian Beltre got in there. Sticker auto, very sweet, 5 of 10. Michael Kopek on the dual stripes, and the top has a stripe as well on card. 12 of 99. Michael Kopek, again, this one, very sick. This is a sticker auto, though. Three colors on that top relic and the stripe out of 10. Jonathan Losiaga that in there 13 out of 49 beautiful relic with the stripes following it up in the back roger clemens sweet auto with the gold lettering this is eight out of ten and the relic nice button and of course the two uh the three color relic on the bottom this is jake cave three of ten sean Minea got in there two of five uh, excuse me one of five sticker auto and the relic three color Luis Ortiz on the button. Very nice. This is numbered out of 10, 2 of 10. And it says John Smoltz got in there with the sticker auto, 8 of 15. All right, Susie, here's the creme de la creme. The creme de la creme. Let's do it. This is Alan Trammell coming up here. This is numbered out of 5, we believe, on the pure redemption. Very sweet. Urias got in here for San Diego. This is the first time. This is 46 out of 49. Silver auto on the eye black and two colors on one of those relics. Very nice. Followed up with his button and another on-card auto on this one. Two of ten. How about this one of one printing plate for David Fletcher? Very nice. Three relics on that and they are buttes. Two or two color and that one is three. Very sweet. Eloy Jimenez got in there. That is 37 out of 99. Two pinstripes on the bottom. Or three pinstripes, excuse me. Very sweet. The one of one Mitch Hanniger dual button printing plate with the on-card auto. Insane. Bo Bichette, gorgeous. Those relics are popping out. They are too thick for that. Very nice. This is on-card prospect auto. Very sweet. And to end the night, the Tatis beautiful two bat relics the yellow and the brown in the center and the two 
color relics on the bottom 25 26 excuse me out of 49 and that is the break awesome break Susie very that nice is a lot of cards very very much so and what time to draw I for I need to double check that if we have 10 minutes or if we don't yeah, we're going to check one second on what time the actual schedule time is here for the uh, Leaf Rookie Yeah, because I'm was i never sure what time, you know, we're going to finish up. So I have to give it a guess. I'm really looking forward to see what comes out of the Leaf Rookie Retro. Susie and I opened some boxes ourselves. We, we called it for 11.30, so we are right on time. Right on time. Let's go. Let me pull up that list. There we go. Let me move these cards out of the way and into our hearts. Good luck, everybody. Yes. This is by uh, the last name we said. Unless uh, somebody comes up, uh, we looked up like a guy like Ichiro on his rookie card. Some of his rookie cards said Ichiro. Some of them said Ichiro Suzuki. If Ichiro Suzuki comes up, we go to the S. Or if it's just an Ichiro card, we go to the I. Yes, uh, we follow what's on the cards. card. Yeah, these are all rookie cards. The first one is a uh, special card that they produce, low numbered a lot of times. Some of the best rookies you'll see like Tatis come up, you know, um, I'm trying to think who else. I don't know if Vlad came up before. I, I got remember. a Mo Bamba 101 out of Mo one Bamba, people. yeah, 101. Uh, yeah, hopefully we see. There you go, Prim Time. I'm with you. That's Rob. You forget because he changed his name or his picture. Rob, yeah, I always forget the new name. You, you always confuse me with that, Rob. Always confuse me. Glad Susie said it. Susie is on fire tonight, Rob. And I would love to see some huge hits right here. Again, we opened the we opened a couple boxes ourselves. One of them came uh, had a Max Scherzer, uh, Gemini Ten, which was nice. We also got a, uh, a silver what um, uh, for Sacramento, Susie. Oh, yeah, I already sold it. Yeah. Marvin Bagley. Marvin Bagley. We got a silver Marvin Bagley graded uh, gem in tan, which was cool. We are, Susie already sold it on hey, our, Mark. there. Hey, Mark. And uh, Susie also opened, which was nice for us, a uh, an upper deck, uh, uh, up Griffey. Uh, Ken Griffey, Griffey Jr. Jr. Yeah, Griffey Jr. rookie gem in tan. It's for sale already in our eBay store. It was beautiful. So we love this product. Good luck, everybody. And since it is the time, I'm going to start opening up this box. If anybody has any questions, I mean, there's not that many slots in here. And again, it is a cornucopia. Any sport can come out. I've seen it with golf coming out. I've seen it with football, baseball, you name it. Oh, nice and smooth on that. Guys, I am pretty excited for this. And I have been loving Immaculate this year. I am digging it. We have more. I put more up right away. We are going to the Nationals, so nothing is going to break after Monday for a couple days. Are we ready to start? Man, Nick. I get another. I would let you know. In fact, I think we have some more bad ones. Let me see here. Let me get my list up here. Good luck, everybody, here on this. I'm going to pull out the base first, and of course the base will also go, but base does not count as a hit in this product. But it is not too shabby. Let's start here with Dwayne Haskins coming out on the Rookie Retro Base. This one is not numbered, but it is still pretty sweet. Going out to the H spot, yes. Let me see who has the uh, H spot. Crazy Going. money guy, that is Craig. Crazy guy money, yes. Crazy guy money. Yep. Congratulations, Craig. There you go. And the first to strike, and it is sweet, Marty. You'll be jealous. It is Jerry Rice going out to R. Very nice on the 1986 top. Oh my God! Ooh, Mint yeah. nine. Wow, bang. Mint nine on that card. I don't know what they saw in this that was not perfection. Maybe a little bit on the corner, but it is very sweet on the Jerry Rice rookie card for the Niners and the R spot. And that's going out to Nick. Nick, what a first hit. Love it. Very nice card. Bang. Wow. Stang Lover rooting for G. Good luck, G, for you, Stang Lover. Nice first hit, Nick. Congratulations. Congratulations. 
way to start it off. And again, in a break like this, or the number one, you always want to just get on the board. So very nice, and nice way to go too with the Jerry Rice rookie card from the '86 and tops. I love it. And I'm with you. I don't know. It's hard to see the flaw. There's one little edge, I guess. That was all I saw. Mo yeah. Bamba coming up here on the rookie retro base, not numbered. And our next hit, we stick with football and we go to Russell Wilson on the W spot. That is a sticker auto on that as well. 9.5 Gem Mint on the 2012 Topps Chrome Rookie Auto. Very killer. And that is Beckett 10 on the auto as well. So we got Russell Wilson. Very sweet going out to Nick with the W spot. That paid off. I'm sure a lot of people looked at W and were like, who's going to possibly come up in W, Susie? We were looking up. Like athletes with the last name starting with X. Yes, and uh, <laughs> yes, yes, true. But wow, nice hit. Russell Wilson, of course, one of the best quarterbacks in the league. And this, obviously, his rookie card. That is killer, Nick. With the auto. Wow. wow. With the auto. I mean, it's crazy. That's a crazy great hit. 9.5. Wow, nice hit, Nick. Congratulations. Numbered out of 20, 18 of 20, Will Greer on the blue. I'm assuming it's a wave refractor since this is leaf. Very nice on the rear. Going out to G. Very Stang nice. Lover. Yes, going out to there G. Go, Stang Steve. Lover on the board. There you go, Stang Lover. And how about we do a Shohei Otani 10 Pristine coming out. This is 2017 Bowman Chrome Mega Box going Prospect Refactor. Oh spot. Wow. Who had the O spot? That is Keith. Wow. Oh my God. What a hit. The Otani. Ba bang. Very wow, sweet. on the nice rookie card, nice on that the way. Yeah, yeah, mega box prospects refractor. I've never seen that card, but that is nice. That is nice. I don't have anybody watching to tell us about that card. That nice card. There you Congratulations, go. Congratulations, Keith. Very sweet. I safe. love it. The 2010 Bowman Crow Mega Box Prospects. Nice refractor. Rookie retro. Card is Anthony Simmons, one of seven on this with the black frame on the outside going to S. I do like the base cards in this too. They're really nice. And yeah, Anthony Simmons, Anthony Simmons really came on. That was one out of seven, Susie. I did say. Anthony Simmons, yeah, beautiful one. And this Very is nice. somebody I guess might come out. How about an autograph rookie Tatum? 9.5 gem mint, nine on the auto. This is a sticker auto and it is 2017-18 Donruss Optics Signature Series Jason Tatum. Killer on the T. Yeah, we were talking about who besides Trout is on T. I said, what about Tatum? And Tatum, yeah, has just, uh, all you read all, is all summer about how hard he's working. Very nice rookie Tatum card. Who had the T, Susan? Let me see. I know. T going out to Nick. Yeah, the beginning of the alphabet, we see a lot of you, Nick. Well, the, the beginning of the reverse alphabet. Yeah. Yes, killing it, Nick. There Very you go, Very sweet. Nick. This product is awesome. We have... Nolan Gorman coming out on the base. This one is not numbered, but goes to G. And here is Hockey making. G is, is uh, Stang Lover again. Yeah. Here is Hockey making an appearance. It is Elias Peterson coming out for P, and that is Gem Mint 10. Young Guns, Elias Peterson. Here he is on the Canucks. Very nice one. Let me see going out to the P. P spot is... Uh, I don't want to mispronounce it here. Beret 14. Congratulations, Beret 14. If I uh, if I butchered that, let me know if you're here. Beret 14. Congrats. Nice, hit, nice hit. This product is fun. You never know what is going to come out here. I do. Like I still feel product. like we got some more killer stuff. Well, we're only halfway through. And the Russell Wilson is sick. Jerry Rice is sick right away. How about another Anthony Simmons coming out? This one is number 20 of 20 with the pink. Very nice. The base. I'm sure sometimes too, Susie, not that I know every single card, sometimes we look up these cards too and we're like, oh wow, we forgot to really, uh, you know, hate that card. That was an awesome value card. Yeah, so well, how about case. this? This coming up for Pete again, 1985 Tops Tiffany Kirby Puckett. Near Mint Mint 8 on that. Very nice. Kirby Puckett rookie card. Nice in the Tiffany. Uh, Jim and, you know, eight, you'd like him to give you something a little better, but. You know, 85 Tiffany, again, I think that's still pretty rare to find those. Uh, I don't know how many they made in 85. I know it was more popular like 87. But the Pocket, let me see, Kirby Pocket. Barrage, 14, nice. What was that, back-to-back -back hits? Beret. Beret, yes, Beret. Yeah. 
back to back. Coming Are you up here, there, another Dwayne Haskins on base. That is 17 of 20. And this is sweet. How about going out to B? It is Barry Bonds, Gem Mint 10 on the 1986 Tufts Traded Barry Bonds rookie card. Gem Mint 10, sweet on that. Yeah, still a desirable card. Not easy to get that one in 10, just because of the borders and the top of it. Very sweet hit there. Very nice on the uh, top traded. Barry Bonds. Sweet and I hit. did like a PSA grade on yes, that too. Very nice hit. Nick. Buck. Bang on that. Maybe we'll find more of this at the National. That would be cool. Or at least some loose boxes of it for personals, maybe. Definitely. Because yes, we, we bought some that were going to be personals, and I opened them <laughs> Yeah, as soon as anybody says that, we'll get some boxes for personal and right, and then they just get opened right away. Juan Soto on the base, numbered out of 25, 2 of 25. Speaking of which, we still have a Leaf Valiant case to open. We also have, uh, yeah, Leaf Trinity, Susie. We have Leaf Valiant, I think, football and, and baseball. Let's get into the L's and Mark Copeland, 2016 Upper Deck. Patrick Lane coming out for hockey. Gem Mint 10. Young Guns. Nice. Going out to the L spot. Let me see that L. Mark. L. Very nice. Mark Copeland. Sweet. Let's hit that sweet J spot a little action. I know they're looking I'm for I want to see a Jordan. I want to see a James. I would love to see either of those. I would love to see a Trout. I'd love to see Chris Bryant. I'd love to see Kobe Bryant. Bryce Harper. A lot of guys. Yeah, Bryce Harper. I'd love to see a lot, a lot of the big guys. A little repetitive here. Another Griffey. Here on I know the, base. the Griffey we'd love to see. Mo Bamba coming out on the base. That is 10 of 10. If you want to see the one of one of that, it is up for sale in Suzy Sports. We do have basketball. Let's see who we got. How about Dwayne Wade coming out? Gem Mint 10. 2003 Topps Chrome on the rookie. Wow. Draft pick number five. Beautiful card. PSA graded. Nice. Love the Wade. Oops, sorry, these cards are shiny. <coughs> Guys, we have one box left. On the tops, Chrome, yeah, Gem in 10. That's a nice hit. Way to go. Love the W. Wow, there you go. Last card of the night. Good luck, everybody here. Let's hope for a killer, killer one. Love this product. If you haven't seen it before, love this product. We have a lot of big breaks in the way. So Another tomorrow night again, uh, Juan Soto. Number. And the final card of the night, going out to our autographed Josh Rosen, coming out Gem Mint 10, 2018 Panini Prism on the Rosen Rookie Auto Red Wave. That is a sticker auto. Very sweet for the R spot. Yeah, is that 163 number? 163 out of $199. Very nice. And a guy who's going to re reborn. I feel like he's going to be reborn there. Very nice. Very nice break, Susie. Very sweet. Some hits and very nice cards. All right. Why don't we do a uh, quick recap here. I'll put them in order. Why don't we start with these three. Thanks, Nick. It's a fun product. We have Patrick Lane came up. Gem Mint 10. Very nice card. And that is not numbered, but it is 2016 Upper Deck Patrick Lane going to L. Going to P, it is Elias Peterson, Gem Mint 10, also hockey. Very nice. We have the Josh Rosen Rookie Auto Red Wave from Prism, 2018 Panini Prism. Excuse me, Sticker Auto, very sweet. Can I have the next one? The Barry Bonds, Gem Mint 10, very nice card. 1986, tops traded on that. Nice, go to 10. The Near Mint Mint 8, Kirby Puckett, 1985, Topps Tiffany, not an easy to get set. Very cool. Then we have Dwayne Wade coming out, Gem Mint 10, beautiful, 2003, Topps Chrome. We have the Otani coming out, very nice, 10 pristine on this 2017 Bowman Chrome Mega Box Prospects Refractor. That is very nice card on the Otani O spot. Jason Tatum, Rookie Auto, Sticker Auto, 9.5, Gem Mint, 9 on the auto. My guess is it's a 9 just because where he hit the bottom of the sticker, there is a little bit of bleeding. It is sweet. 2017-18, Donruss Optic Signature Series on that. The 1986 Jerry Rice, 9 Mint. Very nice. Beckett graded. Sweet. And to end it, we did have the Russell Wilson 
Very nice. 9.5 gem min and the auto is a 10 on the sticker auto. That is the second break of the night. A lot of fun. 